The best vlogger alive. The best vlogger alive. The best vlogger alive. Been here for a while, just in a Hoxton hotel, chilling. Just did enough uploads. Boy. Yeah, let's toast to the success of the interview I just did alongside. Tommy, say yo. What's up, man? What's up? Just on the way to meet Sam, Mr. Doodle and Tom again just to catch the last part of the mural. Yesterday I came back so late from work. Been so tired recently. 21st of April, London, Westminster Bridge, probably in the Bay's location. But yeah, it's another day. Last energies for the weekend. Today I woke up, looked at my phone, I've been summoned down to Bracknell to do a filming job. And I've done it now, it went alright still. I have no idea what to call this vlog. None. But it's time to cook that. It's time to take out the freezer. to the Emirates to go and watch Arsenal versus Man United. I've got the jersey with the yellow socks. Yes boy, we're back in North London. Ain't been in in a while. Not since Marshall lived in the halls, but this is the first game I've been to this season. Obviously this season has been bullshit. It's been absolute bullshit. But, it feels nice to be going back to the Emirates store. Really, four minutes and going on. AFTV Young Guns. Young Guns, so this is the Arsenal Fan TV channel for the Young Guns, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Bro, I'm a genius, bro. Make sure you subscribe, <laughs> check it out. Yeah, good stuff. Can you write it so that you get the top of the yeah, I don't want to spell it wrong. On the topic of vloggers, I'm not sure who the best vlogger in life is. I feel my technique is unparalleled. Why well, it's not like I just watch other people's channels and I don't see just the basics of filmmaking. Obviously, I said I think that Casey Nice is the best vlogger in life, but you guys should have me in the comments below. Let me know who your favorite vlogger is and why. I could just be like a challenge to it, man. I'm not the best vlogger alive and who is? Because I think the quality control of YouTube can be poor. Really, really poor. So yeah, 
I know you're the best rapper in life is. But I like to meet you. Alongside Mar Marley Brent. <laughs> <laughs> guys that is um i want everybody to list their favorite youtuber on the comments below so your favorite vlogger your favorite youtuber maybe even using the hashtag best vlogger alive i don't know if it's cheesy i don't really care i just want to try and create some engagement and just really find out who you guys perceive to be the best vloggers in this youtube game i also have another announcement to make guys um so basically when i was at the game i'm not sure i fully deeped what was like happening but i was part of ask fan tv snapchat through that I've got a few more subscribers so whoop de whoop I'm now on 100 sub that's propelled times forward I've always planned to do a 100 subscriber Q&A and I guess today is the day I've never done anything like this before I don't have a clue what you want to ask or what you'd like to I don't really know how these things work but spread the word and I'm guess I'll got I'll give myself roughly like what a week just to compile some questions I'm gonna post uh, post face or social media like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, blah blah, and YouTube. Anything you'd like to know, like how since it's my first one, I will actually answer anything that's asked. So yeah, there's a vlog star challenge, which I think is in just under two weeks' time actually. The Monday after this, I'm gonna go to it's the second part of the competition. So me and Marshall will be heading off to the YouTube space in Kings Cross. I'll bring the vlogging camera along, and that should be really cool. In addition to that, obviously there's a John Kilby documentary, which will be released really really soon but if seriously if you like culture if you like history if you like pecking you like graffiti you like art you like music history any of those stuff 
give that a watch. It's a mainly audio typed interview, but it's really interesting. I would like to do more interviews with people like that. So yeah, I also dropped a Ford article the other day. I know I'm supposed to have dropped my It's Nice to Travel video before, before now, but it's linked to that. I will drop that video. I'm gonna work on it and I will release that at some stage soon in the year. But in the meantime, just have a read of, um, it's just like a recount of my time in Rio. Um, this, I'll put the link in the description box below and let me know what you think. Finally, I'd just like to say thank you to everyone who subscribed to me thus far. 100 subscribers, it's, it's a start and I, I'm, I'm grateful, I'm grateful. So I just wanna say thank you for those who've been subscribing day one. For Marshall, who's like, as far as I know, what is like liked all my videos that's sick like <laughs> she's watched all my stuff i remember emmanuel when you came to my house on new year's you said you watched all my stuff i don't know it's just like sometimes when you're doing this and you just see the views and it's like it's very discouraging like thinking right why did i do this but then you actually think like people actually seriously watching your things there are souls behind these figures people are watching your work so i'm always 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 grateful for people just to view my work and yeah of course if you make videos as well please 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 above all shout out in the comments let me watch some of your videos because i as a youtuber i watch way too little youtube and part of me wanting to do this video is just to expand my horizons and just like introduce myself and everyone so i just get to see like the good work in youtube because i try browsing sometimes but as i just mentioned the quality control is like you don't always come across i just want to interact with more people who are passionate about what they do whatever that is and yeah that's it i guess so um yeah thank you for watching today's video hopefully this part isn't too long to edit um obviously when Wenger's beat done his hoodoo he's beaten Mourinho what can I say Arsenal top four hopefully hope you guys have a good Friday